Hey people, what's popping? Kilan Shale, again the name, eh? Let's go there. Okay, wonderful people, beautiful people. It is your favorite Achalu Godera Gizel on the microphone. If you are new to Jesus, I'm a tip. <laughs> if you are new to my channel, I'm Chidera Gizel, a Nigerian lifestyle vlogger living in Oberi Imo State. Welcome to my channel. So, you guys, I'm so excited today. <laughs> I'm sure you must have been hearing the excitement from the hey people. Yeah, I'm so excited. My babies are arriving today. By my babies, I mean my furniture. Or is it furniture? Or is it furniture? They are arriving today. My wardrobe, my bedstand, my drawer. Oh my god. I'm so so happy. I'm so so elated. Finally, my room is going to have some shape. Like you guys, once this thing comes, with the way Owu Sagam now, eh? Once this furniture comes, I doubt if I'm, I'm adding any other thing to this room. If I add any other thing, maybe just one or two things. You, you, you see me, you see Pinterest. <laughs> I think we're not going to work out though, but let's see how it goes. Shall you never can tell? There is nothing the Lord cannot do. There is nothing the Lord cannot do. There is nothing the Spirit of God cannot do. There is nothing my God cannot do. Yes, there's nothing God cannot do. So Pinterest may still work. But for now, I feel like after this furniture, I'm never going to stress my dear life again. So you guys, I'm waiting for the furniture guy. I'm actually hurrying. Like I'm going to somewhere. I have to go do something. Na 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 na. Like urgently. And he's taking time. I don't know why, but I just decided to start this vlog. When the furniture comes, I'ma come back on camera. So yeah, my furniture is here. It's right here, right here. On the ever life and direct. So at this point, they are carrying the wardrobe upstairs. And by the time they put in the bed stand and put my bed on it, this was how it looked. It sat so pretty like so so pretty so the guys brought in everything and after bringing it in they coupled the ones they didn't couple at the workshop <laughs> So they brought the furniture in this bus imo. Like this bus imo is so mysterious. You see it and it's just a little bus, like a short to land. It can carry a whole lot. So you guys, this is the next morning and I just want to actually show you the furniture very well because it was already late when they left yesterday. So this is an oval shaped mirror. I asked for them to make the mirror oval shaped, like kind of round. I didn't want the conventional four corner mirror. Yeah, so if I'm able to, I don't know, I may put a light here or something, I don't know. But this is the mirror and this is the vanity table. Yeah, so it will have my cosmetics and stuff. This is the inner part, this is how it looks on the inside. I need to clean this stuff actually. This is the wardrobe. is it uh, it needs cleaning so, so it's a three door wardrobe yeah i asked for three doors because i want to do this thing i want to be keeping my tailoring materials inside the wardrobe too i don't want them lying in a bag i don't want any bag on the floor of my room i just want the furniture and the decorations to be the only things in the room so this chamber right here yeah, i need to shift back so you guys can see this Oh, the bed stand is hindering me so you can see this door right here is where i'm going to pack my tailoring material so it has three steps like so perfect for me thank god it's not like the other one that is straight so i'll put some things here some things to stay here and the others will stay here probably clothes i want to sew will be here some materials will be down here just anyhow shall look for how I arrange it but all of them will stay here then this remaining part will be for my clothing I'm still contemplating whether I'll be putting load up there I'm still contemplating because anything I put there will affect the look of this room and I want this room to look like 
a master's room water so here's the bed stand yeah here's the bed stand so i actually love this bed stand like this is what i love the most in all of this the bed stand and a bedside drawer the bed stand has i i actually wanted them to make it just four corner without that thing and the upper part because the price they were calling was so much just to add that thing at the upper part but last last shall i shall later still got it anyhow anyhow but this is how the bed looks and i'm so glad like i love my all white furniture and here is the bedside drawer Yo, this is it um here is how the lower part looks so that's basically it for this room yeah i'm so glad i'm so glad <laughs> you guys see that my flower that is in the bright red is sitting pretty over there so you guys i don't know if you can see me because i'm currently using my back camera anyways i'm about cleaning the furniture i guess this is going to be the hard part of this white furniture like this is going to be the hard part literally because I have to be cleaning as much as possible yeah i'll be as frequently as possible so i'm about cleaning this because it got stained at the workshop where it was made yeah it is white so it's definitely get stained and even if it does not stained, i'm still cleaning it because it's new and it's still smelling wood wood you know the way fresh wood smells so i'm currently with my broom I'll sweep out the wardrobe and probably the drawers. I'm not sure of sweeping out the drawers. I'll sweep out the wardrobe. Then I have water and soap here. Yeah, I'm not using detergents because I don't know whether detergents be bad for the wood. I don't know anything about maintaining wood. But I'm just using ordinary soap and detox. So I'll use it to clean it up. Then I'm going to be arranging this part today. I want to be putting my tailoring materials in this part. So I'm going to be sweeping it out first and cleaning it out first so I can dry and I can pack the tailoring materials now because my stuff are in my sister's room and her room is messed up because of the way that I just so I have to start arranging this place before she starts getting angry. Yeah, so let's do this. Wardrobe. So imagine if I didn't sweep it and I just take cleaning it. So I made the cleaning so irritating. So I'm just going to sweep off the room. <laughs> That was how I cleaned everything up, the wardrobe, the drawers, and the mirror. I handled the mirror with extra care because I didn't want to come and talk story. So you guys, I would love you all to tell me what you think about my new furniture in the comment section. Do you think I chose the right colors? Do you think they are looking so pretty? They are sitting so pretty in the room? And yes, for the price, because I know some people will be interested in knowing how much I got the furniture. So I got the furniture for 
a bit over hundred thousand naira yeah over hundred thousand naira a bit over it yeah something like that i don't want to say the exact amount i don't know why <laughs> but it's over hundred thousand naira and my plug is in obiru so if you're in obiru and you need furniture um i think i'm going to put his his phone number in the description box so that anybody that needs his services can contact him so let me know what you think about this furniture in the comment section if you enjoyed this video do give it a huge thumbs up subscribe to my youtube channel subscribe subscribe share this video let's move this ministry to the permanent site and hopefully 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 i'm going to be seeing my next one for now bye kiss kiss love you